If you're a BAM fan, don't talk to me. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to a Vlogmas Day 5. Oh man, yesterday was a lot. If you guys watched my vlog yesterday, I really liked yesterday's vlog. It started out with a little self-care morning and then getting after it for the dogs. We lost. I don't know what happened, but we lost. And yeah, it was a pretty sad night, pretty distraught about it. I went to bed at like 10 o'clock last night, straight up, like was out for the night. Um, I've had myself a little lazy morning. I got the vlog up, watching vlogmases. I love this time of year. I'm drinking a LaCroix. I haven't even had coffee yet because I just feel like kind of like anxiety vibes. I don't really know. I just feel like weird. So I don't want to like add to my jitters with coffee, but at the same time, I love coffee. It's such an internal struggle. I'm honestly like, trying to figure out what to do with my day. It's Sunday, I love Sundays, and I wanna do something festive today, you guys know me. But also like, my apartment's a little, just not, I, ever, I feel like they say this every day, but like I wanna clean it. I have some random things I need to get done. I need to pick up some groceries and like paper towels, just random stuff like that. I don't know, I really don't know where today's gonna go. Usually I feel like I start the vlog and I'm like, all right, we're doing this, and then this, and then this, but I really don't know. So this is gonna be an adventure together. Um, I know today's gonna be a good day though. I'm not letting today be a bad day. But yeah, a part of me like wants to be a little active maybe, hop on the bike. But also like, I don't know if my body's ready for that, you know? <laughs> but yeah, I just wanna be real with you guys. So I feel like first things first, we need to put some eye patches on. I feel like that's usually how I start my day. Hold up, hold up. I just realized I didn't even light my candles this morning. Am I okay? Like that is just how we need to do it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Candles are lit. We're good to go. <laughs> Eye patches are on. I'm gonna do one of my teas from my tea advent calendar. This is a caffeine-free lemon, ginger, and manuka honey tea. That sounds perfect right now. I love lemon, I love ginger, and it's caffeine-free, so I don't have to worry about any of the jitters or anything. Not that I really ever feel anything from tea. My mom will like have caffeinated tea and she's like, whoo, bust. Mm. This looks scrumptious. So I feel like in order to kind of clear my head and figure out, you know, how the rest of my day is gonna go and just kind of feel a little less anxious. I, um, I'm not gonna do my full doing all daily right now. I'm just going to take this notepad and just write down some things that I want to do today and just get it out onto paper and kind of see what it looks like. There's some Christmas gifts I wanna get for people that I'm seeing this week before I go home from New York or for, for Flor to Florida. Um, I'm hosting a secret Santa here at my apartment on Wednesday, which I'm so excited about. And I just need like the final touch for my gift for my person. Okay, so I need to write that down. Yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and write everything out onto paper and see where I get from there. <laughs> Just made some rice and beans for lunch. I already had the rice pre-made, so I just heated up some beans. I put um, balsamic vinegar in the beans when I cook them because it's so good. My mom always did it, so it was just one of those things. Yeah, and I just got ready too. I'll show you guys my outfit in a sec. All right, ginger shot of the day. Cheers. <laughs> oh. That feels great. <laughs> okay, you guys, I'm all ready for the day. Feeling good, feeling refreshed, recharged. Ryan and I just made a little plan. I'm so excited for the day. Um, we're gonna head to Union Square Christmas Market. I am so excited. I've been wanting to go. Today is the day to do it. He's looking for some decorations for his apartment. 
Um, so I don't, I can't remember. I've been once before. I can't remember if it's like only Christmas stuff or they sell other things. I feel like they sell other things, but I can't remember. But either way, it'll be a good little festive afternoon. And then potentially tonight we might go um, either to the Botanical Gardens or to, I think it's called Diker Heights. Um, they have like amazing houses decorated for Christmas and that just sounds like such a vibe for a Sunday night. So updates to come, we'll probably pop into places as we go. I have some Christmas shopping to do, so I'm hoping I see some things. Uh, Ryan also wants to get some fresh plants for their outdoor area. So it's just gonna be a random day, but we're gonna start out there. I'm really excited and I like my outfit. I'm gonna show you guys. The shacket returns. I'm obsessed with this thing because it's super thick, like it's actually warm. So here's an overview of the fit. These are the same pants I wore yesterday. They are so flattering. I literally don't ever wanna take them off. Um, I've just got this turtleneck underneath from Urban Outfitters literally years ago. I don't think it exists anymore, but I like how it's long. And then this jacket from American Eagle that I will link below, as well as my pants I will also link below. They're from Revolve. And then I'm just wearing my Air Force Ones because we're gonna be walking a lot. And then I'm bringing my black Chanel bag that I got from Agora Vintage. Um, and yeah, that that's the fit. I'm so excited. Let's go have a festive day. Let's do it. in the mood for some holiday markets today. It's pretty crowded. Yep. Good vibes. What do you think, Santa? Looks good to me. Looks festive. <laughs> they have like fresh cider, donuts. It's so cute. I feel like a couple years ago I went to uh, the German Christmas markets with Sephora collection. It was so cool. Oh, hot chocolate. What, Ryan? Colorful cookies. Colorful cookies. Might need. Ryan, do you want to tell everyone where we're going right now? Going back to American Whiskey. <laughs> we're going back to the UGA bar because Ryan realized today that he left without his debit card last night. <laughs> so yep. it's okay. We left, the game hadn't even finished yet. I called an Uber and ordered Joe's Pizza to my apartment all at the same time and we just left and we watched the rest of the game at home in sadness. So we are headed back to UGA bar today. Trigger warning, it's gonna be a little a little distraught, but it's oh, okay. Yeah. It's not as UGA. -y. Yeah, I don't think they have the flags up on other days other than Saturdays. But um, Ryan, how do you feel about the game yesterday? A lot of people um, really saw your passion in yesterday's vlog. It was a tough game. Came out flat. Alabama was the underdog, and they kind of—I think that's what fueled them. I think that's they a, were like ready. Yeah. They had the good rat poison or something. That's how Saban described it in the post-game conference. But anyways, hopefully this will fuel us for the next two because all Orange that matters Orange Bowl. Now. Yeah, we're all playing that Michigan. Now. Ryan's mom went to Michigan. New Year's House Eve. House divided. New Year's Eve. So we're like, New Year's Eve is about to be hopefully a good night. Yep. But I think this is a, it's a good, this will be good energy. Good or energy. Light a fire under him. Yeah, Ryan was not happy last night, nor was I, but he really... He really took it to heart, so. I was, he was acting as if he was on the team. I was like, it's okay. We're approaching American Whiskey now. Praying they have his debit card because we're up in Midtown now. And then we'll see where we go from there. Woo! Oh, and the Christmas market was so cute. Adorable, very packed though. Didn't get any shopping done, but it was very festive. It's all cute, I didn't realize this yesterday because I was Oh wow, this is the UGA bar on other days. We've got the Macy's window displays. Ryan, they're known for their window displays during the holidays. It says Believe right there, it's so pretty. If you guys haven't seen Miracle on 34th Street, this Macy's, that's what this Macy's is all about. Okay, we're gonna play a little game. Ryan came up with it. Do you wanna tell them what we're gonna do? We need to get dinner. We'll get on, do two stops, three stops, whatever, and then get off, find a place there. Yeah, so he had the idea to go, we're gonna go on the subway towards like our apartments and we're gonna get off in two stops, wherever that may be, and find somewhere to eat there. So it's like on our way back, 
but not completely out of the way. Okay. Gotta put my mask on, but let's see where we end up in two stops. All right, so two stops was 14th Street, which I think is like NYU area. I have no idea. We're just gonna find a place, see where we end up. Okay, I think we're in like Greenwich Village area right now. So we're like walking to 14th Street right now and then we're just gonna turn down a side road and find hopefully like a cozy little restaurant. We ended up at a Japanese restaurant. We're sitting at the sushi bar, we can like watch. It's pretty cool. All right, came back to my apartment really quick to change and get a little <laughs> oop, comfier. Ryan and I were gonna go to Diker Heights and look at all the Christmas lights, but right before we left, cause it's like 8.30, I was like, let me just make sure there's not like hours, hours on this. And it did say a lot of the homeowners turn off their lights around nine, understandably. So we don't wanna risk it cause it's like a 30 minute Uber or like an hour train ride over there so which is so fun and so down another time but it's a sunday night and it would just take a while and if we got there and the lights were off i'd be sad so we're gonna go see house of gucci i haven't been into a movie theater in so long neither is ryan and it just sounds like such a good vibe there's a th theater in the east village i think that we're gonna go check out and get some popcorn with the movie theater butter and just enjoy a little movie together so that's exciting so i changed into this sweatsuit it's the same one i have that i wore the other day from boundless loungewear it's just in a different color i just wanted to be comfy for the movies i'm gonna put my jacket back on as well it's like a 20 minute walk so we're doing a lot of walking today we walked 30 minutes back from our dinner but yeah let's go see house of gucci i'm excited Well, we are back from the movies now. It's 12.30. It was a two hour and 38 minute movie. We had no idea, um, but it was so good. I learned so much. It's so wild, honestly. Um, not what I was expecting. I thought it was kind of more about like how Gucci was started, but it's really more about like the Gucci legacy and the family behind it. And it was so interesting, so. I'm back now, I'm so sleepy. We've got another full day tomorrow, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'm gonna just relax a little bit, and then, well, I guess I'm gonna relax in bed. I'm gonna go to sleep, is what I'm trying to say. Subscribe if you guys are new here, and I'll have a new vlog up tomorrow. Bye, guys.